In 1981, San Francisco had essentially stopped planting street trees because of the drought. So a small group of us decided this was not going to be acceptable. We wanted a greener city. We knew people wanted street trees. And so we just decided to organize and we got Friends of the Urban Forest going. This is the site of the first Fuff tree planting in Noe Valley. I'm pretty much assuming that any tree that looks like it's more than 10 or 20 years old is because of Fuff. So I think we really have transformed the city. Of course, there's a long way to go, but we really have made a difference and you can just see it. The city is far greener than it was 30 years ago. If one thinks about the subject of legacy to future generations, imagine when San Francisco was founded, it was sand dunes. There was no tree tradition here. And I have to say my satisfaction when I go around the city and see all the street trees that have been added and are flourishing is incomparable. In fact, I often think if I never had done anything else besides have my children and work to help FUF, I could die happy. It's so rewarding to see what this little group did starting 30 years ago and how it has matured and, as I say, continued to flourish. One can't overemphasize the importance of staff in how an organization runs, but staff can't do it all, as talented and effective as they are. The staff relies on the members and the donors and the supporters of the organization. I'm Senator Dianne Feinstein, and I want to take just a moment to thank the Friends of the Urban Forest for the tremendous work you do to make San Francisco a greener city. As a mayor, I was delighted to participate in one of your very first tree plantings. That was a while ago, and I was proud to work together with you to update the city's tree ordinance. As someone who was born in, lives in, and loves San Francisco, I really appreciate your work and the work of your volunteers and supporters. Remember, there's plenty of room out there for more trees and tree upkeep, I might say. So please keep up the good work and thank you. So doing uh, plantings in the neighborhoods is a great example of how, how the plantings create communities because people come out and talk to each other, neighbors come out, you know, you're talking about your tree, people drive by, roll down the windows, hey, how'd you get that tree? Uh, you know, kids come out, it's, it's, it's pretty remarkable. It's so affordable and it's so easy and something that would be a really daunting task for somebody who doesn't have the resources. And so giving to this organization enables people who might not be able to green their neighborhoods by themselves to do it through Friends of the Urban Forest. I've been uh, planting trees around uh, almost every neighborhood in the city now for close to 30 years. Um, probably have planted over 7,000 trees. I should say health plant because this is a community effort. One of the things that always intrigues me is the way uh, people living on the same block, uh, living in close proximity for 10 or 20 years have never met each other and they meet over a, a, a tree. It's also their children who meet for the first time over, over a tree planting. Um, I can't even find the words to express how moving that is. Friends of the Urban Forest has played a huge role in San Francisco's urban, urban forest. They have planted many, many trees and we would have many fewer trees if not for their efforts. They also do the city a great service in raising awareness about the importance of trees and education about proper tree care. Street trees are a really important part of our green infrastructure. They help to clean the air, they take up pollutants, uh, they also help to manage stormwater. San Francisco actually has a lower tree canopy than a lot of cities of a similar size. And what I've noticed in the last seven years as urban forester for the Department of Public Works is that when San Francisco has had some pretty bad economic times and we have faced budget cuts for the last successive few years, we're really seeing the impacts to our ability to plant more trees and to maintain the trees. So we really rely on the partnership with Friends of the Urban Forest. As you walk or drive through San Francisco, nearly half the street trees you see have been planted by our staff, our volunteers, and neighborhood residents. We're very proud of that number. Yet there's another number that we at FUF are aiming for, 70,000. 
That is an estimate of the number of locations in our city that could accommodate a tree, but don't yet have one. Imagine how beautiful San Francisco would be with almost double the street trees we currently have. But beauty is only one of the benefits that trees provide. Trees improve air quality. Trees play a vital role in protecting the bay. Trees improve public safety. And finally, trees improve property values, paying for themselves many times over. Simply put, trees make our neighborhoods and our blocks healthier, safer, and more valuable. For 30 years, FOF has worked to make San Francisco a better place to live, work, and visit. We could never have done that work without the hard work of thousands of volunteers and the financial support of our generous donors. Your generosity can make our city even better over the next 30 years. There's no better way of leaving a lasting legacy than planting a tree. Help us plant those 70,000 more trees by supporting us today and join us in transforming San Francisco into the greener city we all know it should be. Thank you.